Representative is wanted by police why an arrest warrant was issued for Kevin Boyle. This morning, a Pennsylvania state representative is wanted by authorities. Philadelphia police have issued an arrest warrant for Kevin Boyle. CBS News Philadelphia reporter Jasmine Payot joins us now with more on the story. Good morning, Jasmine. Good morning, Jim Janelle. Boyle has represented the 172nd, which includes parts of Northeast Philadelphia and Montgomery County since 2011. He is currently seeking his eighth term. But this morning, his fellow Democrats say they have some serious concerns. Now, take a look at this. Police have issued an arrest warrant for Pennsylvania State Representative Kevin Boyle after he was accused of violating a protection from abuse order. Sources tell CBS News Philadelphia, Boyle texted his estranged wife, which is a violation of that order. Boyle was arrested in 2021 for harassment and violating a protection order filed by his then wife. His attorney at the time called it a domestic issue. Now, those charges were dropped and Boyle told constituents in a letter in 2022 that subsequent treatment at a mental health facility helped save his life. But just two months ago, a video went viral showing Boyle allegedly threatening staff at a bar in Montgomery County. Police said they received information that Boyle was drunk and possibly under the influence of drugs at the time of that incident. Now, take a look at your screen. Now, this is from House Majority Leader Matt Bradford. He sent in this statement to CBS Philadelphia. It reads, I love Kevin, but I have serious concerns about his mental health, and it breaks my heart to see him this way. I hope he gets the help he needs. Now, this incident could have a significant impact on the balance of power in Harrisburg. The Pennsylvania primary is just six days away, and Boyle faces a stiff challenge from fellow Democrat Sean Doherty, now who has the party support. Republicans are also hoping to flip the seat in the general election in November. Right now, Democrats hold a slim one-seat advantage over Republicans in the state house. We reached out to Boyle's team for a response, but we have yet to hear back, Jim. Thank you, Jasmine. Appreciate it.